Hello everybody, Mary Zagady Gay here, coming to you guys with a get ready with me video. I have already um, cleansed and washed my face and primed it. For primer today, I use the Baby Skin. I've been trying this, so I use it. You saw that in one of my haul videos for my birthday. And then on my eyes, I just use my Urban Decay primer. So I've already did my brows. Usually for the look I'm doing today, I wouldn't necessarily put on a full brow, but it is time for me to um, clean these bad boys up. So I like to clean them up when I already have them filled in so I don't lose my shape. So I'm getting ready to pick my husband up from the airport with the boys, and I wanted to do a nice, natural, sultry type look. Come hither, if you will. Uh, I'm honestly not sure what I'm going to be wearing today, but I do know that I want it to look very natural, very neutral, and very bronzy, you know, golden, and um, heavy highlighted. So, I think I'm going to stick with my basic little look. Right now, I have Warm Honey for this LA Girls Concealer, and I figured I'd do like a frequently asked questions while I do this, so... Yes, it's going to be skipped through, but I promise you, the part that I, you know, edit out, I'm not giving you anything juicy that you wouldn't want to know. So, while I do my highlighting, my under highlighting, the first thing that people always ask me is in reference to my video about number two's birth. The main question that I get is... Did I have a menstrual cycle while I was pregnant? And the answer to that is none of your business. Like, what in the world? I mean, yes, I understand people why they want to know that, but I'm not going to be talking about my cycle all on YouTube. Okay, who does that? No, I'm not talking about that. And that's none of your business. So please stop asking. That's the answer. Okay. The next frequently asked question I get is what is the baby's name his name is number two um you know i share what i like to share i don't share what i don't want to share and but i will tell you that my boys all have the same initials like their daddy so they're all kdk so that is what his initials are um let's see another frequently asked question i get not necessarily about that that's pretty much the only two videos i get about that um, I mean, the only two questions I get about that. The next question I get asked is, um, what is my name? My name is Tanisha. I know. Don't I look like a Tanisha? I mean, not like this, but don't I look like a Tanisha? Yes, my name is Tanisha. And my husband's name is Kevin. I get asked that a lot. I figure since I've been on here for like, what, three or four years now? I might as well share that information. But some of you have found me via social network. And you know, anyway. Um, I'm setting this with the Hula Benefit Powder. I'm going to take the Elf Smudge Pot in Cruising Chic. I really like this one. It is my favorite Elf Smudge Pot. And it is so beautiful. It is so beautiful on. It's a beautiful color. It looks beautiful on the lips. I just, I love this smudge pot. It's gorgeous. And today I'm going to blend it out real good because I'm going to put just a natural, um, shadow over it. But I did want it to have something to stick to because we are in the Lone Star State. Okay. We're going to go into LP2 and get this um, light brown. So, I'm just going to put that all over. Kind of soft little look. Um, let's see, what else do people ask me? Some people have asked me, going into Mocha here, some people have asked me, do I have any siblings? I do. I have a little sister. We're 17 years apart. I am 32, and she will be um, 15, probably by the time this video goes up. So, 
and that's my only sister um, with my mother. I am my daddy's only girl and only child. How cool is that? Okay, daddy's girl, only girl. Okay, awesome. And I have my middle sis. When I refer to my middle sis, I'm talking about my sister-in-law. And she is a million and a half years old. No, I think she's, you know what? I think um, she's 24. So I always tell her, you're pushing 30, okay? She's pushing 30. Not really, but I say that to her to scare her. Because 30 is scary. No, it's not really scary. And I never, ever get her age right. Like, every year I know I'm going into Chrome. And I'm going to sweep that over my lid, too. I never get her age right. I mean, I guess it shouldn't be hard because I just should subtract 8 from my age. Because she's 8 years younger than my husband. And that's his only sibling. So, when I say little sis, I'm referring to my little sister, when I say middle sis, I'm referring to my sister-in-law, and I'm the big sister, only because I'm the oldest. So, if the order was reversed, then I would reverse the names as such. Okay. Just going to take some beige and put it in the high hat corner of the brow bone, just right there, lightly. And that's it for the eyes, so I'm going to move forward and talk a little more. Um, for my concealer today, I'm going to be using the Dream Matte Mousse in Dark 3. I actually tried this as a foundation, and I didn't really like the color of it, but I will say whenever I want to wear like a natural foundation look, that this has been really good as a concealer for me. I have not went back. I do plan on going back. I was going to actually exchange this for Dark 2, but I think I'm going to just keep this and buy Dark 2 and see if I like it. Um, but we'll see if Dark 2 ends up being too light. But I do like to use this as a concealer. So. As contour today, I'm going to use my Maybelline Fit Me in 360. I bought this powder because I, the 355 powder is definitely something that I would wear on a daily basis. But I figured this I could wear it rather than wearing any foundation. But when it sets in my skin it is so red that I hate it so I'm just gonna give myself a light little contour with this because again I want to look bronzy and sultry we'll take it on the nose and we'll also a little bit there, like this, yeah. Okay, so I'm loving how I look, but I do want to add a bit of definition to my eyes. So I'm going to hit up this Ulta Smoky Eyes Liner, guys. This is the bomb, bomb, bomb best eyeliner that I own. I'm going to tight line with this. My upper water line and then put a little bit on the lash line. I don't know if you guys can see. That made a difference. I'll look over here. And I look over here. See how that made a difference? So I'm going to do the same over here. I'm just going to Now how I tight line my my upper water line is that my how I tight line the top is I keep my eye closed. And then when I want to bring it up, and then I just bring it up. We're going to hit them with the Benefit They're Real Mascara. Mm -hmm. Okay. I'm going to set my face with my LA Colors Press Powder in Mocha. And that's MP314. So I'm just going to... Okay. buffed in and that just kind of pulls it all together I prefer using a pressed powder that is like the same color as my foundation so using 
the 360 even though it was my skin color so I thought once it you know it just was super red and to show you the difference between the two colors now see how it just blended in it just made me look blended and seamless I'll show you the difference so this is this is 360 and this is mocha so you see the difference in the two colors use the light color right here and I'll highlight with that um so another frequently asked question that I get sometimes is about my husband how long we've we been married we've been married for seven years um, some people also ask how we met and for that I just refer you to my video we did like a whole little video set super glue but I'm blended out on how we met called all things we and I never meant to do one of those series and I did another set I never meant to, for us to do one and not do any more but we will it's just it is so hard with his working schedule people have asked what my husband does he works okay bless the Lord he works happily works he travels a lot for his job so like two days a week sometimes three or four sometimes every day so and um, yeah he works for a cable company and he is a, a nice basically he's a, he's a, he does good with selling stuff so right now he um, he sells the cable company he, he does a great job at it my husband is the best at everything he does and that's a fact it's not just because he's my husband it's because it's a bona fide fact proven by his commission hmm, how about that so what else do people ask let me get some blush going here I have my ooh la la femme blush palette um oh this is one people always ask and I think because I don't know what I'm going to wear yet, I want to look bronzy, I'm going to hit up this golden sunset right here. And I'm going to mix it with a little bit of russet underneath it. So I'm going to russet on the back end. So you see that russet just gives me a little whoop de doo on the back end. And I, yes, I'm off with the overdone blush. But on the front end, I'm going to put Golden Sunset. And I told you guys, I'm flicking on these little films. Yes, yeah, something that people always ask is, um, am I a preacher? Uh, no, I don't do that. Um. And so then people come back with a, well, is your husband one? Yes, he is. Okay. Oh my goodness gracious. No, he is. I don't know how, I don't know how y'all get that from the thing. I don't know that it makes a big difference. Um, I guess I will say the difference about my husband and most other preachers that you may encounter is my husband is balanced. He knows how to live a balanced life. That does not mean that he, you know, sins. Okay. Monday through Monday through Saturday and then Sunday he preaches the word but that just means that he knows how to live a balanced life he lives his life unto God every day so one thing that people definitely say about us we are the same every day I'm the same person over here I'm the same person off of here like people that have talked to me they say that um yeah so we're the same so we definitely live balanced so that is it guys um I will show you the lip color in some pictures and I'll put a notation of what it is but I'm gonna do a second segment of this um, when I stop I'm gonna take this elf HD blush and superstar and do that for my lips and if you guys are interested in my other um, in a dupe for candy yum yum or a dupe from um, matte cream cup then I'll put a link to that video below so this is how it looks on the lips Yeah, there we go.